Hello and welcome back to another episode of Two Point Hospital here on Broadside Game with me Zug and uh, yeah we're just going to carry on with the campaign we're going to make ourselves a Super Chew Hospital and where the fuck are we? Oh, here we are we can see if we can like actually like be better than one star I don't think we will uh, tip the most out of your staff when you need to train and promote them. When somebody has gained enough experience on the job and had some training, they will be ready for promotion. By promoting them, their skills increase and they are able to learn a new qualification. They might also want a pay rise. <laughs> Good fucking luck with that. Firstly, though, we'll need a training license. The Two Point Health Ministry has prom uh, promised to grant us a license if we can demonstrate our commitment to staff well being here in Flottering. Okay, well. Um, need a reception first, don't we? Okay. And you just—I know it needs an assistant. Game, Jesus Christ! I've only put it down a fucking second ago. No. Oh, what am I doing? I've already forgotten what I'm doing. There we go, hire, that's what I'm doing. You, assist people. Right, GP's office. I want to see if I can squeeze as much into this hospital as I can. Oh, it has to look into the hospital, apparently. Okay. That's good. I have to hire a doctor. Pharmacy. Can I make this a really s no? Cancel the room. I'm not sure what I'm going to do there then, because that's kind of God. And the fucking desk is around the way. There we go. Yes, I know he's annoyed, but whatever. Those doors are really awkward. Can I get rid of them? No. Okay. Extinguisher in there as well, because no doubt they'll set that fucker on fire at some point. Need a nurse. Ew. You are nurse like enough. Alright, let's just pause it for a second. Oh, that, that little bit of space has really fucked me. I don't like it. So the door is in the wrong place. Can I do something with that door? Rooms. Okay, we're gonna move the door for some reason. I might restart this one. I don't like what I've done already. I don't like it. It has annoyed me. We're only four minutes in, so whatever. Okay. Okay, so this is the front. See, it's the, just pointless doors as well. They don't need to be there. Okay. So it has to be...
No. There has to be at least three by three. Okay. See, I don't. I still don't like that. GP's office. Can we squeeze a GP's office in here then? No. Oh, so we're just having to squeeze toilets in there then. That's a room. Yes, cancel the room. There. Or an assistant. And do we need a GP's office? Two, three. So I'll see if we can do it three by three as well. Spin this around. Put a lovely plant in there. Everyone loves a plant. And a fire extinguisher because we're all about safety here. Okay. We want some benches so these motherfuckers can sit around and wait. And we did a nurse. Oh, yeah. A pew and a doctor. Doctor required in GP's office. Uh, yeah, we'll have you. And we did janitor. Right. Now we're gonna put some churlets in. Can I sneak a staff room? Oh, I can sneak a staff room in there. Okay. Now we're radio. cooking with gas. Our reporter on the field, Sally Fig Blanket, has just returned with her camera crew from another field trip. As to what she was reporting on, I cannot say. Nobody tells me anything. Right. They and now some turrets. They're going to be small toilets, but... Ah, they don't need hand dryers. Right, so we need a ward. Okay, so we want a fairly sizable ward. Out to about there. The door there. Mm. Well, I say sizable, I mean more than two beds. Nurse on the ward. Perry Lion, that's a strong name. Another diagnosis room. Oh, everyone's complaining that they let's just pause that for a second. Oh, we want a drinks machine. Oh, we want we want to not be on fire. Well, luxury none of you can afford.
the bin. Because I doubt any of these people can fucking put stuff in a bin. Uh, leaflet stand. Okay, so the ward's here. So what we're going to on this bit. And then we'll stick a psychiatry room there. I'm still probably not making the best use out of my space, but I don't care. Okay, so we can now build a training room. Oh god. Clowns. Ugh. Oh, in clowns. Today's sponsor is Rent and Eel. Rent an eel for all of your short term eel based needs. Okay. This is Two Point Radio. Do I need a training room? Please clean up after yourself and others. Uh, hmm, which way do I want to do this? I'll do it that way, I can't use that space. Okay. Training course, click on the lectern or drop a suitable member of staff into the room. Staff will also require training when they're ready. Um. Okay, so why won't let me start training? What do we need now? So we've got a cardiology and staff room toilets. I oh, need a deluxe clinic. Fire extinguisher. Let's work this thing out. So, I want to say I want to do Oh, I have to put in a guest trainer. Okay, right. I understand. I think. Oh, that's how you do it. Right. You on a certain
Do I have enough doctors? Maybe. If ever you have found yourself at a loss as to the correct usage of the English language, you may enjoy my popular guide to good grammar. A public service I perform with no shortage of humility. I will do one to okay. proper enunciation as well, but I fear your underdeveloped vocal abilities would make this quite impossible. Um. Oh, that's a big fucking device. Not sure which way round it goes. Let's just go with way round. Okay, we can upgrade our drug mixer. Do I have... Oh, we don't have a janitor that can capture ghosts, though. There's no doubt we're going to kill someone at some point, so uh, yeah. Capturing ghosts might be useful. I suppose what we could do is no one comes in this way why don't we utilize this space to make another GP's office Sticking up GP's office in there. And we're just going to ignore all the flashing lights and warnings because they're probably nothing. Nothing we need to worry about. It's fine. he want I have uh, only one word to say to you today trousers people trousers they ought to be worn at all times they protect against sunburn and knobbly knee syndrome take heed dear listeners okay and I think this Oh, we're having a mayoral visit. Okay. We've got a pan slab so we can deal with it. If you have any questions, first ask yourself why that might be. Uh. Doctor required in pan slab. Okay, maybe we need another 
psychiatry room then. Join me in welcoming the mayor to the hospital. They're gonna be fucking bitches about it. We'll make another one. Stormy, me, 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 fuck you. You will wait like everyone else. Let's put in another pharmacy as well. Fuck okay, it, slightly large pharmacy. I think somebody died. Doctor to psychiatry, please. I feel like I'm running out of money really quickly. If I don't look at it, it's probably fine. Shit doctor in there. And get a shit nurse. Or actually we'll get a nice nurse. I'm kind of just going with the tactic of just throw loads of money at it and it'll probably be fine. Okay. Yeah, I did it. I'm the greatest. All right. I meant to be building a clown clinic. All right, that makes more sense. That's why everyone's angry at me. makes a lot more sense now why everyone is getting really really bitchy at me what's the clown clink need requires a nurse okay Now I'm just going to assume the hospital is going to run itself and everything's going to be fine. Got all my bases covered. Play. Um. Seems all right. Let's just, just throw some plants around. Everyone likes plants. We need the seating areas. Cheer these fuckers up a bit. Caution. Always proceed with caution. Yeah, 
they see everyone's fucking happy now. They love those plants. It's a very strange machine. Where are all my goddamn doctors? Okay, so we're fixing that. Do we have enough janitors? Just throw more staff at it. It's fine, probably won't go bankrupt. I'm like the exact opposite of the Tories. I'm throwing more money at it. We'll have loads of staff. We'll have 15 doctors to every one person. It'd be great. Where's that goddamn assistant? Or a more qualified assistant. I've started exploring past lives. I've tried hypnotizing myself with pendulums and pocket watches, but I find listening to my own voice works best. I say one thing and then no, we could do some thing. seating there. And I say one thing and then another thing. It's possible you're now hypnotized too. Get some more plants in there. Very happy corner of the hospital. Plant. These motherfuckers love plants. Oh, what does this one want? Exceptio, right. Side manner. We'll have our chief nurse and we'll train. Oh, she's so fucking good about everything. Give me a fucking challenge. Fuck you. I'll say if we're gonna have janitors or not. Yeah, one of them's fixing something, the other two are like keeping an eye out if there's any problems. See, look, they got loads of jobs to do. Game, fucking telling me what to do. Maintenance announcement: Toilets need routine servicing. In what rooms are the busiest? Seems to be okay at the moment. What do we need more bins? People want bins, I can give you bins, you know. I think I can spring for a bin at this point. Yeah, 
Okay. Plans now arriving at the hospital. Come on. Yay, clowns are arriving, my favorite. Inject some chance into your life with probability. The drink that rolls the dice of life. Probability? What's the worst that can happen? 24 hours a day. This is two, two, two Okay, radio. let's go. Diagnosis. Get guest doctor in and we'll train. Okay, yeah, now I'm, I'm losing money now, which is bad. I'll take a small loan. Another GP's office and some more clown rooms. Maybe two GP's office because people really want to see a GP. Yeah, I fucking know. I just said I was going to build one. Arsy little bitch. And the new pharmacy, maybe. Okay, just pause this for a second. Clown clinic, we need to de clown some people. Okay, that won't fit there. Yes, cancel that. Rooms. Fill it with shit. Apparently, people love shit. Uh, GP's office. See over here. One cabinet up in that bitch. Water extinguisher and a plant. So you know the score by now. Plants will fix everything. General diagnosis. These in as well. Oh shit, did I not build a fucking general diagnosis room in the main hospital? God damn it. That's probably why they're also really irritated with me. That would 
probably do it. Shit. In my defense, I'm not very good at this game. Yeah, that might have been a bit of a mistake, that. Yeah. Don't know what any of it means. I'm gonna assume it's great and they think I'm the best. Oh dear, well we've hit about our time limit folks so we're going to save it there and uh, we shall carry on next episode and see if I can repair this fucking train wreck of a hospital if not we'll just have to do it again but hopefully we can repair it because not building one of the main needed rooms from the start may have hindered us ever so slightly it's fine we can fix it absolutely fine so until next time folks thank you very much for watching if you've enjoyed the content of the channel please like subscribe hit that little bell for notifications and i shall see you all next time see you later